Hey guys, it's only a couple seconds long. Uh, my pastor and his wife just came back for a sec, but I was checking some um, messages. Sorry, I'm, I'm pretty sick today. Um, look, I, I wanted to clarify something. There's only one gospel. Everybody that's ever been saved has been saved by looking forward to or backward to the cross. So I had some uh, viewers send me messages saying, no, I'm sorry, Renee, the dispensation is not true, and you're saying there's more than one gospel. I've never said that. I stand on the real gospel, which is 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 4, that Christ died for our sins according to scriptures, was buried and rose again on the third day, according to scriptures. And those scriptures were what the people before Christ's death, burial, and resurrection stood on. And they didn't really know exactly clearly what they were standing on. They had shadows, like, you know, animal sacrifice, which was the shadow of what Christ would do for us. But I, I just want to clarify that. I don't know how people are hearing me say there's more than one salvation. Uh, on another video, I said salvation can mean more than one thing. You can be saved from more than eternal damnation. So when it says repent or perish, it's talking about physical death. You see, you can be saved from yeah, the second death. You can be saved from the consequence of sin, saved from um, uh, all kinds of things. And so we have to read in context is all I was saying. And when Jesus is talking to the Jews under the law, because he said, I came but for the lost sheep of Israel. Sometimes we have to rightly divide if he's talking to the present day church or to Israel under the law to show them how they fail in keeping the law to save themselves and to repent, to turn to him in faith. That's all I was saying. So I'm hoping I clarify it. I, I don't know how people hear what they hear, but if, if I'm just not feeling well and I'm not clear enough, uh, I'm really sorry. I, I'm in a lot of pain today and I wasn't going to make any videos, but it was like on my heart because there was a particular viewer that was in a lot of pain and I really wanted to answer something for her about what faith was and that faith is not obedience. It's the evidence of things not seen, the substance of things hoped for. It's to be convinced or persuaded that something's true and put our hope and our trust on it. Okay, so uh, anyway, I hope I answer that. I've never said that there's two different gospels ever, ever, ever. Please don't misunderstand what I say. Please try to hear me if I'm not clear. Talk to me about it, but I've never said that. I just said we have to rightly divide to whom uh, scripture speaking and in what context. Okay? God bless.